As we know, the IPCC is a political institution, not really a scientific one. So it uses the science uh, for its own ends, which is why, for example, we've had cases of governments, Belgium, Germany, putting pressure on the IPCC to not to tone down the report, but to, but to tweak it and make it and make make it sound scarier than the scientific reality justifies. This, this much quoted 95% figure is a classic example of this. It's 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 a bit like getting uh, people to say 95% uh, certainty that, that, that the sun will rise tomorrow. Well, yes, the sun will rise tomorrow, but that's not really the subject that's being debated, is it? It's, it's, it's how, what the temperatures will be tomorrow. The, 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 they are, it's, it's a sleight of hand. They're talking about 95% certainty that, that man influences climate. Well, I would, I'm surprised that they couldn't get 100% of scientists to agree on that one because it's, it, it, it's a given. The question is the degree to which man influences the climate and whether actually we can, we can this is anything we should worry about and, and whether we should be bombing the global economy into the dark ages to try and stop it. All the computer models that the IPCC has used in its 25 years of existence, all of them have predicted, forecast, whatever, um, global warming much greater than has actually been observed. And this represents a problem because it, what it means is that the all these um, all these insistent claims that they've been making that we need to take urgent measures now to deal with this this unprecedented problem, they seem to be based on 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 junk science. It, it, the, the, the IPCC at the moment stands or falls on its computer models. There is no other evidence out there that global warming is in any kind of problem. It exists only in the in the imaginations of the of the people who program those computer models and the scientists who contribute to those the, the theory that anthropogenic CO2 is a problem. Yeah. Well, what we see in this report is that the evidence suggests that the models aren't working, which suggests that the entire the entirety of AGW theory is is flawed.